Hi guys, I'm going to be unboxing Up the Wag Collection for the PS1. A little overview, this is a role playing game originally released by Working Designs and it came with Arctolad 1, 2, and 3 as well as Arc Arena which is like a Pokemon style uh, Monster Hunter game So right now I'm showing you the back of the box. This collection came on, what is it, five discs. It also included, oh you can read what it included right here. Five game CDs, one making of CD. Um, a hardbound instruction book. It came with thumb buttons for your um, DualShock um, analog sticks. It had a memory card holder. And just like Luna Eternal Blue Complete, it came with the character mini standees. As you can see right there. And what was interesting about these games is that they all continued the storyline and the saves also continued. Arctolad 3 was the only one in the series of 1, 2, and 3 to feature 3D graphics. Arctolad 1 and 2 was more of a traditional 16-bit role-playing game. 2D sprites. And the gameplay generally comprised of um, a tactical strategy role-playing game type of battle system. So this is a box. Next here is the jewel case CDs. This is the front. The side. the back. Inside. This is the disc for Arc Arena. Says Monster Tournaments. The next next discs were for let's see Arc the Land One. This is Arctolad 2. And next we have Arctolad 3. This is the making of CD.
And lastly, we have Octoad 3 Disc 2. Here's a back graphic. Next I'm going to show you the OMAC, OMAC box, this is the front, <coughs> the side, this is the back. This is what you get, and these the, there's four of the analog uh, thumb covers. They're just kind of squishy rubber things that you put over the the nubs. This one says Octoad Collection. This one has different characters and this is the memory card holder it's basically just a simple plastic case nothing on the back Next, this is what the character standees look, at, look like. I haven't opened them, so they're still folded nicely. So that's what comes in the Omak or Omake box. Next I'm going to show you the manual and just like the Lunar Eternal Blue complete and Silver Star Story complete, um, the Octolad Collection instruction book is um, leather bound, also has a little red ribbon like a bookmark. the back of it this is a spine here's a table of contents Flip a few pages. This manual has 151 pages. Also, if you pre order the game, you got this watch as a bonus. It came in this metal case.
like a keychain watch. <clears throat> Has a little clip that you put on your keychain or your belt buckle. It's a pretty nice, heavy duty watch. Feels heavy. So there's Octolite collection in the middle. The back is blank. So that's the pre-order bonus. One moment. Okay. Next I'm going to show you some reviews from some websites. This is from IGN.com. dated May 2nd, 2002 and they gave this game an 8.8 .8. Next a review from GameSpot They gave this game a 7.5 And lastly I'm going to show you some gameplay footage of Octolad 1 which is pretty similar to Octolad 2 in gameplay. So basically it's like a strategy role playing game where you move in tiles. Everything is 2D. And last but not least, I am going to show you the hardbound strategy guide. So stay tuned. Hi guys. Um, right now I'm going to show you the guide, hardbound guide for Octolad Collection. And this is official strategy guide by Working Designs, and it covers chapters one and two, so it doesn't cover Octolad three. I'm not sure if um, they released a separate guide for Octolad three. So this is the front cover. This is the side spine. is the back five hundred seventy pages full color maps three sheets of character and memory card stickers and a what does it say uh, Octolad Collection Poster 2. So I'm not going to open this, but that's basically what the official strategy guide for Octolad Collection looks like. It's also pretty thick. So hope you enjoyed uh, an overview of the contents of Octolad Collection as well it's as its pre-order bonus the pocket watch and the official strategy guide <laughs>